Hello, my brothers and sisters. Hope you're all doing well. Hope your morning is being blessed and hope you're praying and reading and getting closer with the Lord. And that's what this video is about. You know, we start our day with uh, other things sometimes that are on our minds and we miss the opportunity to start our day with Jesus Christ first. And like I said, it happens to the best of us. It, uh, everyone that's walked this earth and everyone that's a believer in the Lord, we have those days where we get up and sometimes there's so many other things that uh, are going on and are pressing and we just move forward without praying first or talking with the Lord first. And like I said, it happens to the best of us. But today I want to make sure that we do that and with this video, I want to make sure that we continue to pray every day, continue to pray first, continue to pray at the end of the day. You know, God blessed us by opening our eyes. And I know we have to go through the trials and the tribulations like we always talk about, but there are a lot of good things too in this world. The creation of the world itself is beautiful. We do wake up and we watch the sunrise. We watch the stars at night. We watch the moon beautiful creation. You walk outside, you see some beautiful trees, an incredible ocean, an incredible sky. And that's all a gift from God. God made a perfect planet for us. Unfortunately, we ruined it. <laughs> but uh, no, there are some beautiful things in this world. And uh, like I said, by the creation of it, but today, let's start our day with, with a prayer, as we should always do. And I make the short videos morning and night for me and for all of us. We're a family. We're a family in Christ. <clears throat> well, let's put him first. Let's make sure everything we do is for him first. And like I said, I know we have those days where you wake up and you're late for work or you're this and that, and just your mind wanders in a sense I shouldn't say wander but it just just the uh the hectic the hectic i should say of this life and, and sometimes we don't put them first but today we will put them first and every day we will put them first so when we wake up we wake up with the lord we wake up with jesus on our hearts and on our minds and in our souls So today I'm going to say a prayer together with all of us. Like I said, we can never pray enough. And like I said, I make the short videos, but we can never pray enough. It's never enough. We could always pray. The Bible says pray without ceasing. So I'm going to say a prayer for all of us, my family in Christ. Father in heaven, thank you for waking us up and opening our eyes. We know you are a good God. We know you are in control. We know that you love us. Watch over us today and every day you do bless us with. Give us the guidance, Father. Give us the patience that we so need. Give us the wisdom of your word and give us the strength of your power to fight off the fiery darts of the devil and to can continue to get through another day. So Lord, as we wake up, we acknowledge you, we praise you, and we love you, and we are thankful for this beautiful day you have given us. Today is the day the Lord has made. Amen. So my brothers and sisters, Let's remember to keep him first. Because he is first in his heart. We I should say we are first in his heart. We are his creation. We are his image. So once again, thank you, Father. My brothers and sisters, have a beautiful day. Thank you for watching. I mean, God bless you all.